down the creepy hallway uh, of the dilapidated di stairs. Down the creepy hallway. Okay. Of course. I think you're being sarcastic, but I'm gonna go this way. Just a wee bit. <laughs> anyway, now. Uh, oops. More oil for the lantern, sir. Okay. I think things are about to start getting scary. I hate how the roaches oh. are everywhere. It's in a box. There we go. Uh, oh, hi, roaches. They gross me out. Crash! Die! Oh, come on! Ew! Well, that was a mess, but the other ones were spot on. Nice. Yeah, I saw that when I was going to pick up the crate. Um, I wonder what could be in here. Insanity? Oh, hi. Oh, well. That's uh, just fantastic. Yeah. Okay, well, I guess we can't go that way either now. I like how all these pictures of Roman... Or of Roman... Oh, come uh, on! There was a direct hit! the box at the wall! Oh, there's no way that'll work. Yeah, I think I'm going insane. Okay, up the stairs. <sighs> well, thanks for giving us a choice game. Not that I like games that give you choices or anything. On the stairway, you must wait. So, wait, we still have two options, apparently. Until uh, the plant... Which way do you think? Up the stairs. I kind of want to go this way. Down the creepy dungeon way? Yeah. Of course you do. Oh. Oh. Can we go this way? Laboratory. Wait, I want to look down here first. Dexter's uh, lab. Which way do you think? Oh. Uh, definitely not the creepy... No. Let's uh, go into the mist. Okay. We'll go to the laboratory. See, so he's figured out how it works now. A fragrant taste of rose lingered in his mouth. Turkish delights, he thought. Just like the ones at the consulate in Constantinople. I'm like 90% sure that nobody would know where Turkish delights are if it were not for the Narnia movie. Exactly. I quite frankly forgot what they were. I think they're like little jelly cubes That's covered so with too. powdered sugar or something. And usually they have like, um, um they're eaten with crackers. Or... The crap? Okay, hi. Okay! So. I'm a stutter last night. What was that? The hell? Um. Oh, there's buzzing. Oh, gross. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, fantastic. Okay. It's so realistic looking. Okay, let me uh, toss in some more oil. Alright, let's investigate this over here first. Uh, oh, look, spiders. Whoa. Well. Definitely go uh, that way. I don't think we can. Mmm, beautiful. Oh, my. Oh, delicious. Oh, look, bricks. That's bricks. <laughs> I think so. Ew. Well, I can throw bricks really far. I wouldn't pick anything up in a pile <laughs> of rotting stew. Alright. That's just me. Yeah. Light the lantern, won't you? Huh. That's not so, creepy at all. We've got a vial. And I'm going insane. And it's blinding light. And there should be more Cooper acts. Oh, wow. Huh. Let me see. Let me see. So, I think I'm insane again. Yes, I am. And one part aqua force. Oh, what is this? Oh, great. Oh, I love the blinding light, okay, man. I'm telling you. Pot. It's just fantastic. A pot used to contain mixtures. Okay. Would you like to do the honors? This is my third attempt to produce artificial vitae. The formal compounds lack the potency I need. But I sense I'm close. Calamine and Oropiment are a given, and the cuprite binds them well. This time I would send Aqua Regia instead of Aqua Fortis and hope it will produce a more even solution. The experiment was unsuccessful. The solution is highly acidic and proves impractical to put to any use except as a detergent. Hmm. Organic tissue reacts especially violently to the solution and should be handled with the greatest care. I might be able to use the recipe. But I'm losing hope that I'll find it an alchemic solution to my predicament. Uh, okay, so we can read a hand. I think they are telling us to mix this uh, solution. Aquamagia. So, this is so apparently going to be a great acid. Calamine and orpiment, along with culprite mines, oh, I mean culprite, and aquafortis. Okay. Gonna be like bona fide alchemists. Okay, this looks like there's something in here. Yay! Come on now. Oh, I can crouch. Okay, tinder box. That's kind of useless. Uh, and I think I'm going insane again. Is there something down here? 
I think there he is. Oh, it's just a really long fall. I guess the guy's afraid of heights. What a great hero. Oh, no, you didn't hear whenever he was getting talked to about that voice? No, I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> Ooh, bunny hopping actually makes you move slightly faster. Oil. Five and a half. Okay, so apparently there is no out. Oh, hey. Wait, note. The lack of a chimney to properly vent the fumes from my most recent experiments has taken in toll on many of my less stable ingredients in storage. Some seem unaffected, but many are stained by the fumes and it will be difficult to salvage. I shall do what I can and move them to the wine cellar. Oh, great. So, I guess we've now we gotta go the find cellar. the wine cellar. Joy. <gasps> Ooh, chest. Oh. Oh, you can't open it? The crap. What the hell? Okay. But there is a um, tinder box. Can we open this one now? Oh, hey. It screams. There we go. So, I guess we have um, quite a few tinder boxes. Ugh, flies. Flies and roaches. Hmm. This game's a bit creepy. It's got a nice atmosphere, I guess, but you really can't get into it, it unless like you're. It's a crying baby. Do you hear it? Traveling to Dover and going through Canterbury, he made sure to pay a visit to avoid the sense of guilt connected with the neglected family. Aww. Okay, so apparently somebody is a hateful father. Okay. Oh. Let's go save her. Okay, that actually made me jump a bit. Actually, screw it. Let's go to the wine cellar. <laughs> okay, I'm kind of nervous, but. Oh. It's locked. Maybe it's locked she has the key. Let's go save her. Yeah, because whenever you hear a screaming whore in the distance, you just run to save them. Uh, I'm trying to figure out where. I like how that got brighter. Oh hi. Oh hi. So I'm guessing it came from upstairs. Up the stairs. So let's of go course. upstairs. I mean, of course. Hi, Coda. Okay. Where else would it have come from? Um. Totally. Where's the hammer when you need it? I can't open this door. You won't budge, I can't open the door, man. I don't know. Um, oh. can't go that way. Oh, I have broken stairs. Tee <laughs> Uh, damn it! So many options. Oh, can't go that way. Oh, hello. Ten bucks. It's an odd camera. Won't let me. There we go. I like how you can you have the option of actually crouching down to look at things better and grab them. Yep. Okay, so now we're in the archives. The dorm slammed shut behind him and he knew he would never again see the old tailor at Bursley Square. Another lone soul in London seemed appropriate somehow. Huh. I kinda like this. The storyline unfolds, but not too much. Whoa. Uh, I think I know which way the screen came from. So we're gonna go the opposite way. Wait, what did it say? Catalog? It's the catalogy. Okay, and This is the uh, Libri Libri rare. Rare. Okay, this is the rare, rare books. books. So let's go in here. There's a note. Uh, here's some things. Mm -hmm. Oh, hi, cockroach. Oh, I hate cockroach. Uh, oh, look, there's absolutely nothing in here. Oh, hi, look, I can almost walk through it. So that was useless. Oh, oh, oh. Statuette. Oh god. I missed. Go, go, go. Ah. Missed again. I'm trying to juggle it, but it's not working. <laughs> now let's read the note. 16 May, 1839. Looks like you're out of a job, friend. The unflinching oh, African cool. sun has continued to plague our expedition, making it impossible to dig until dusk. How Professor Herbert managed to find the location in these vast plains of nothingness remains a mystery to me. When I asked him about the tomb again, he told me about the legend of Tin Hanan, the mother of us all. I hate to and do this, but we're sure in his brain. So right, but I shot a ceiling. I kind of like a joke There's myself. More. I think Later that evening, we uncovered a passage beneath the dunes, leading sure to a sand-covered stone going to get some drinks. The professor was confident it was the tomb we sought, and ordered the others to clear the way late into the dark, cold night. Tomorrow, I shall lead the men into the ancient structure, hoping to reach the burial chamber. No matter what the professor is keeping from me, the dig should yield something interesting to take back to London and the British Museum. Alright, so they're um, going into the creepy architecture. 
Well, thank you, friend. You're welcome, bud. The message said that we were uh, going into the creepy structure so they could get to the burial crypt or some crazy nonsense like that. So the mother of the earth. Yeah, I think they're trying to kill themselves or something. Uh, so I'm going to take a sip of my drink and then the game's going to freak out and then I'm going to continue. <laughs> Sorry, you know, bring that up just a little fine. bit more. <laughs> Alright, so now I'm properly hydrated. And I'm properly placed. And I can barely see because it's dark. How much oil do I have? I should have one. Damn. Uh, uh, oh, another pipe. Go ahead. I hereby offer my full attention and services to Alexander, Baron of Brennenberg. This contact will reign for a total of three years when my freedom shall return to me. In addition, Alexander Baron of Brennenberg is to rem recommend my services at the Pres uh, Prussian Royal Court and without the sanctum of the Order of the Black Eagle. May no man break this seal. Wilhelm, House of Gerrick. It's Wilhelm. Ah. It's German, friend. This is why you're here. It's Prussian to be specific. <laughs> why are you Prussian so much, Brody? Wait, can you open those uh, doors on that? Oh, good eye. Oh, good, good eye. Might want to move the chair. <laughs> oh. Because you know they put crap. I bet there's something in here now that the chair was in the way. I'm looking at it right there. Can I take it out? No, I can't. Can you remove the stuff that's in that, uh... No. Doesn't look like it. No. Just stacks of paper. It's like a Bible. Okay, let's see. That fantastic art. Dude, I love how they have that same picture everywhere in this oh. house. Oh, but you could light it. Uh, this picture? Yes, it's the um, Roman courts. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow, it's kind of dark. Either uh, Pleiades or Socrates. Uh, I'm still good on oil. Study. That's stupid. Huh. Do you hear it? I don't hear a thing. They're calling for us. Shirts? Shirts, shirts, shirts. Um, it's kind of cool they hide nothing. something on the very back of one of these. Books? Come on, man. My mouse sensitivity is a bit too low. I'll turn it up later. Alright. 17th of May, 1839. My hand trembles as I write. I feel a need to document my tribulation I for I fear that my memory tomb. will fail me if I linger. Today, I took some men and ventured into the dark, ancient uh -huh. passage Smart. we covered. Our torches burned faintly in the murky air as we slowly made our way underground. The men were superstitious and fearful. They argued loudly, and I felt their strange language getting to me. Getting to me. I mustered my strength and yelled at them to continue down the slopes and broken steps. Oh, the oh, crazy more carved passage Man, this seems confused so long. me. Mm -hmm. It looked much older than the 4th like century structure we had expected. Mm -hmm. The twisting path emerged into a great antechamber. Antechamber? The walls were lined like with it's, statues it's the opposite of a chamber? I'd ever seen. Despite their unearthly quality, I felt a strange familiarity toward them, so which haunts me still. At the far end of the chamber, a great slab of stone sealed off whatever lay ahead. Hmm. I gave the order to raise it, and as I pushed through the narrow space, the heavy stone suddenly dropped, oh, sealing fantastic. me inside. We were trapped. I was trapped. <laughs> <laughs> so fantastic. Oh, it's awesome when you're laughing at amnesia, the dark descent. The thing is, it's a cool game. Oh crap, we have so many choices as to where to go. I'm going this way. Are we, are we still sane? Check in the, um... Mostly. Uh, doesn't look like there's anything. I like how... Wait, go back real quick. Damn I like it, how it's bolted down. Oh yeah. What the hell? <laughs> Who bolts down a, a stone fireplace? That's a good point, Brody. Okay, so we came... Whoa, I didn't know we can go here. Yeah, I thought you noticed this. Lord the lantern? No, I want to steal the oil. Ooh. Whoa. It's like a hot summer's day in this room. Well, look at the creepy vision. It's weird. That's what I'm talking about. It's like a hot summer's um, day. Um, I don't like this room. I think we should go look outside. That one's not bolted down. Oh, it's kind Whoa. of foggy, yeah. 
It's time beautiful time. weather. Oh my god. Look, oh, look at the that's, bright that's blue fantastic sky. Fantastic. Those almost alive trees. 